Now, in this video, we're going to create custom taxonomies. Custom taxonomies is a very easy method to follow on. And uh, what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to create another function that will be actually taxonomies in here. And then I'm going to actually pass on a variable that will be actually holding an array and uh, I'm gonna pass on the parameters that will be actually genre so genre is actually that's it I'm just gonna provide in here the genre means that uh, this uh, game belongs to which genre whether this is an action game whether this is a uh, uh, a, any arcade game or something else genre this game belongs to so this is we gonna have to provide that genre in here and uh, I'm gonna create uh, once again query underscore variable that how we want to actually carry it out I'm gonna use uh, game slash genre and then I'm gonna use uh, rewrite slug in here with array and that will be like uh, slug uh, is this is just for permalinks purposes to make it just like that and that's it now we have actually this section in the next section we're going to have to provide these all labels just like we have done that and we're going to have to actually replace the names and I have already a code snippet for that so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get back in here and under public function taxonomies I'm just gonna grab on these labels out in here and I'm just gonna copy it get back and paste it in here so what we have is now actually this section this public function out there I really don't need this one because we could actually make it far like that so now we have actually this uh, custom labels for our January a dead generate just like that update generate a generate just like we have provided these option inside in here we have actually added a few more items like search popular separate and as well as uh, not found was here and we have added add or remove items and choose from most used generous and these are actually an additional ones I'm just gonna provide a comma in here and save it everything so we have now a generate out there now I'm going to actually create a function out here and I'm going to first call it in that function like uh, register all taxonomies in here and then I'm going to create that function register all taxonomies and then I'm going to actually register a taxonomy that is actually in here so this is actually a built-in function that register underscore taxonomy and I'm gonna pass on a few variables out here in the first argument I'm just gonna actually provide a query variable that how we gonna actually want to query so I'm just gonna actually copy this in here just like that the next what we have is uh, that uh, what kind of genre or something like that uh, like uh, uh, what is actually the genre or the uh, like uh, from what name we want to actually refer to it just like we have actually referred to it with uh, BT underscore game so we're gonna actually refer to it from just like that I'm gonna use an array and then I'm gonna use BT in this code game so from this name we're gonna actually refer this taxonomies and as well as that post type but this is actually the basic purpose of referring to post type and the last one I'm gonna provide arguments which we really want to show it up along with that post so this is what we have is actually the register all taxonomies out in here but I gotta to have to pass on the taxonomies the variable which is actually this one this array this array I gotta have to pass on so I'm just gonna provide a taxonomies in here and then I'm gonna actually loop through each element 
and I'm gonna have to actually register it. So for that I'm gonna create uh, for each loop I'm gonna actually provide the taxonomies. So taxonomies is name is equal to array in here. Now I'm gonna actually change this games underscore generate with the name and this arguments with array. That's it. Now we have actually registered our taxonomy out in here. Now the last thing what I have to do is just call on this taxonomy. And that will be like uh, this taxonomies and this taxonomies would actually be calling out this whole area so I'm just gonna calling out this function in here taxonomies and just save it and now the last thing I'm gonna have to check it out that whether my code works or not I'm just gonna refresh the page and if there is some problem uh, there is some problem with syntax error in here with a custom post type PHP 74 line I'm just gonna get back into the 74 line that is we have actually a syntax error in here and this is what I most usually do this is not actually a pointing I'm just gonna save it in here and refresh the page once again I'm gonna refresh it and as you can see that the error has been removed out and as well as a taxonomy of genre has been added into this panel as you can see that so this is what we have is actually a uh, genre or what we really refer to in out there. Now the next thing I could do actually to just click on the genre in here. And as you will see that uh, we could now add a genre in here. So I'm just going to actually give it a gen action game that would be. And this game is an action game. And I'm just going to add the genre in here and as you can see the general has been added I'm just gonna get back into the game section out there and there is actually I'm just gonna create a new game so for that purpose I'm just gonna give it uh, tumblr I'm just gonna publish it but be before publish as you can see that we have actually that genre appeared out here the action I can actually set it action and not as you can see that so you it depends on you now the next few things what we really have to do is is just to provide the organization that uh, which organization has made this game which studio which organization so we're gonna actually repeat the same kind of stuff as we have done for the genre in here by getting into my code snippet file and copying out that file or you can just actually copy the same kind of taxonomies criteria out here and just copy it and paste it in here so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna actually get back to my code snippet and copy this code and uh, then I'm gonna paste it in here and save it we have now the organization I'm gonna get back and refresh the page and you will see that organization taxonomy would be added in here so I'm just gonna click on the organization taxonomy and I'm gonna give it a name like uh, Bedars Studio in here and I'm gonna add the organization just like that and I'm gonna get back into the game section and now if I just want to create a new game or want to edit the current game like just get back or just edit the current game in here I'm just gonna edit it and now as you can see the organization has also been added out here now you can check the organization as well as the action for the specified game that this belongs to Bella studio organization and the genre is action and you can publish it out